Hi there, this is me your friend Deepak and I welcome you to yet another video of Hydrogel Matters. So let's start with today's topic. So in this video, I'm going to talk about this interview question, which was asked in Morgan Stanley written interview test. So if you can see here, they're asking to get this desired result set by joining these item and sales table. So this is item table where we have five rows and this is sales table where we have 10 rows now after joining i'm supposed to get this five row with item and total number of that items sold from sales table and then if that sales count is more than two then the in this indicator sold more than two should become y and if it is not then it should become no let's start writing a query for this so rather than me writing a single query single big query in one go i would write it in two parts one will get the item and count and second query will get the item count and then sold more than two indicator as well so let's start writing the query so if you can see here i'm writing query on postgres sql because i was unable to install db2 on my mac and even the postgres also i have installed using uh, on my docker only we have using uh, docker and kubernetes a lot in mainframe modernization project we'll create a separate video uh, like how can you use docker for installing different software which is not supported on your platform okay so let's me show you my tables this is my item table this is my sales table let me show you the item tables again okay now i will try to get item and count first okay select a okay so here i've selected a dot item b dot count uh, this is my first table item table this is the second table which i'm going to use it's basically a query result where i'm getting the item id and count where i've used the group by clause on item id so if you see here i've written like we are getting this till these two columns data we are getting here okay now i'm going to write a case statement so that we'll be getting this indicator as well so if you can see here i've written like select a dot item id b dot count and case statement when this count b dot count is greater than two then say yes else say no and then end and then i've given the alias name as sold more than two from item and here uh, it's like as usual like if you see my first query just this is the first table this is the second table first query i have written like i've selected the item and total count from sales table that how many times it got sold and then the second query i have written with case statement if it is more than two times then we are uh, getting yes otherwise no i will give this query in my uh, description as well so this is the final query so here i have used a uh, sub query as well if you see the sub inner query is just i have selected the item id and count of item id from sales table where i have used group by clause and then outer query is like i've joined item table and then the inner query result it's a kind of equi join i have used to know more about the join operations you can refer my video which i have created for join you can see here that this query is working i have joined the item and sales table and we have got the desired results right now guys please do subscribe to my channel it does help this channel and stay tuned for my next video where i will be posting next morgan stanley questions which was asked in written test so thanks for watching i hope to see you in my next video bye bye